Most people say I have the weirdest collection ever, and honestly, I agree. But it's just me making the most of my disability and turning it into an ability. So, let me show you my collection. Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's Jerry Stodd here, back with a brand new video, and in today's video, I am going to show you my collection. Most people collect baseball cards, cars, clothes, and many other things, but I, Jared Stodd, collect eyeballs. As some of you may know, I got diagnosed with cancer when I was only two years old. And the only way for me to survive was for the doctors to take out my eyeball and leave me with one eye. And well, since then, I have been getting prosthetic eyes to make me look like I have two eyes. But then about two years ago, I got this bright idea to get crazy custom eyeballs. And since then, I have been getting so many eyeballs. And honestly, the collection has gotten to be a little too much. Almost $500,000 worth of eyeballs. And today, I'm gonna show you. So with that being said, let's go to my collection of eyeballs and I'll show you my entire collection. So I'm gonna be putting in every single eyeball and telling you the price of each eye. So uh, let's begin with, uh, wait a second. My eyeballs aren't here. Uh, three, two, one. Boom! Just like that, we have all of my eyeballs here. We have 25 eyeballs in my collection. And I'm actually missing two, so I should have 27. But I'm missing my realistic eyeball. It looks exactly like my real eye because I accidentally broke it. So I had to send it to Zach the Ocularis so that he could fix it and send it back to me. And then the other eyeball that I am missing is the Terminator eye. I just got it a few months ago. I have no idea where it is, but I need to find it because I'm in love with that eye. Tori, do you know where this eyeball is? <laughs> I hope that it's just in the bottom of one of your backpacks. I hope so because we have to find this because I miss that eye so much. But anyways, we have all 25 of my eyeballs here right now. And we're gonna start with my very first eyeball ever right here. I got this eyeball right after surgery when I lost my eye to cancer when I was only two years old. This eyeball is so old and so small. You can tell I was just a baby when I was wearing this eyeball because how small it is. It and looks dark. Yeah, like my pupil color has changed throughout my years. Every couple years, I would get a new eyeball. So then I got this eyeball right here, which is a little bit bigger. I wore this eyeball for about two or three years. And then after two or three years, my eye socket expanded. And then I had to get another eyeball. After a few years of wearing this one, I got another one, which is this one right here. And I wore this eyeball all the way up till I was about 18 years old. And now I have my new realistic eyeball. However, that eye is not here because it's getting fixed right now. So this is the last realistic eyeball that I actually have. But now we're gonna move on to my clear eyes. Check this out, I have four clear eyeballs. And these clear eyeballs are basically so, if I wanna be seen without an eyeball in, which I do most of the time, I like wearing no eyeball just because I like being different and being who I am. So I always wear a clear eyeball. This way it holds my eye socket open so my eye socket doesn't close and no debris or anything gets in my eye socket because that would be so bad and I would get an infection back there and that would be terrible. Let's go to all of my custom eyeballs. This is gonna be crazy. The first custom eyeball that we're going with is this rainbow eye. I actually got this rainbow eye a few months ago and it might be one of the craziest eyeballs I've ever gotten because there's so much color, it is so bright, yet it also looks very realistic. So I am in love with this eye. Comment which eyeball you like the most throughout the video, so make sure you guys stick around, watch all the eyeballs, and comment which one is your favorite. But let's move on to the next eyeball, which is this crazy blue eyeball. And let me tell you, this eyeball might be the most realistic eyeball that I have, although it doesn't match my real eye color. Look how realistic this is in my eye socket. But now let's move on to the next eyeball, which is this one right here. And this is actually the SNG Labs logo, which is the company that makes all of my fake eyeballs, Zach the Ocularis and his team at SNG Labs. I don't wear it that much, but I probably should. And the next eyeball is this all white raw gear eyeball. This is a clothing brand and I got a logo of it on an eyeball and it's all white and it's seriously so bright. I never wear this eyeball 
but look how bright this is. And the next eyeball is the one and only TLF eyeball. This eyeball reminds me of like an eight ball eye, but instead I have the TLF logo in the middle. This eye is crazy and it looks so scary. Imagine meeting some random person in public, you go up to them and you only see this of their face. It's like, yo, what is that? Is that wrong? guy okay? Yeah, it's like, this guy is scary. Here we have the all green eyeball. I just got this eye a few months ago. I have seriously like never really wore it in my life, but uh, check this thing out. It's kind of crazy. It's just one solid color. It looks pretty unique. Definitely different. You'll never see this anywhere else in your life. This eyeball right here is a bionic looking eyeball, which is insane. Seriously looks like a bionic eyeball. And what this eyeball is, is Know The Glow. It's the logo for Know The Glow, which is a company that helps people that have retinoblastoma. And now let's go on to the next eyeball, which is the $100,000 eye. I just got this eye a few videos ago. And apparently this eyeball is worth $100,000. We haven't been able to test it out for real yet, but uh, yeah, it doesn't really fit my eye socket the best, but uh, here is the $100,000 eyeball. This eyeball right here was my first ever glow in the dark eyeball. That is right, this eyeball glows in the dark completely, which I'll pop a picture up right here of that. But yeah, this is my first ever glow in the dark eyeball. It has like a hypnotizing look to it. And this eyeball is seriously so crazy. I don't even know what to think about it besides, yo, that is why. So uh, now let's go to the next eyeball, which was my last and final Naruto eyeball that I have. The one and only Sage Mode Fake Eye. The color of this thing is so bright and so crazy. Some people even say this looks like a goat eyeball. This eye might be the most flashiest eyeball ever. This is a glitter eyeball. It is purple with actual glitter in the middle of this eyeball. And this eyeball pretty much represents me and who I am. I like being different, myself, goofy, be unique, because God gave me this disability, so why not turn it into an ability and get all of these crazy custom eyeballs, because it's so fun, and not many other people can stand out from the crowd like this. So this is why I get all these crazy custom eyeballs, but this eyeball is absolutely insane, and I honestly feel like it might be some of your guys' favorite. So comment down below if this eyeball is your favorite or not. And now we have the one and only Renegon Eye. This was the second custom eyeball that I ever got and this thing still is just one of the craziest eyes ever. I have no idea what to even say about this eye. It speaks for itself. It looks so symmetrical, so perfect, and so just crazy. So now that we have this eye, now we begin the last three eyeballs, which I think are the craziest of all. Here we have the Pokemon eyeball. The last time I went to Zach the Ocularist, I got this Pokemon eye, and let me tell you, when you see this thing in, you're gonna be like, oh my gosh. Boom! This is insane. I legit have like a Pokeball as my full eyeball. Imagine a random person sees me in public and they have no idea who I am or anything. And they're like, yo, this guy has a Pokeball as an eyeball? <laughs> Like that would be insane. We move on to the most detailed, the most crafted eyeball that I have, which is the eyeball of myself. This eye was literally painted of a picture of me. It's actually my profile picture, but they hand painted this eyeball and it looks absolutely insane. And the artist of this eye was Hillary at Jaeger Ocular Prosthetics. And this eyeball is just, I don't even know. There's no words to describe it. It is just the most detailed, most artistic eyeball that I have by far, which leads us to the very last, but the most important eyeball yet. This eye is the Sharangan eye, which was the first ever eyeball that I ever got. Well, the first custom eyeball that I ever got anyway, but check this out. This has always been a fan favorite and honestly one of my favorites as well, because it was the first custom eyeball that I ever got and it has led me to where I am today and being myself and being different and just having fun with my disability of having one eyeball. So thanks to this eyeball right here, I have all of the rest of these eyeballs. But I wouldn't be where I am today without this eyeball and your support, so thank you so much. And also, drop a like on this video right now and let's see if we can get this video to 50,000 likes. But with that being said, we have one more eyeball and this is the spookiest one ever. This eyeball is the scariest, most realistic eyeball ever. And it is actually my real eyeball that they removed from me from surgery. Look at this thing. This is absolutely scary. 
And uh, yeah, it's not actually the eyeball that they removed for me from surgery. It is just a prop eyeball that I bought for YouTube videos, but it looks so stinking realistic. I wish I could like put it in and then I could just like <gasps> pull it out of my eye socket, but I can't do that. But I always just use this eyeball for videos. And uh, yeah, that makes my entire collection of eyeballs, besides the two eyeballs that I'm missing, the Terminator and the realistic eyeball. I would have 27 total, wow. and then the gold one is worth 100,000, and the rest are worth 10,000 a piece. But to me, these eyeballs are priceless. I would never be able to sell them to anybody. But anyways, I haven't made this video in over a year since I had only 10 eyeballs, and now we have 27. The eyeball collection has grown so much, but with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, comment your favorite eyeball, and drop a like on the video, and I will see you in a couple of days. Peace!